Hey guys, it's Rob J here, and today we're talking about common live foods that you're going to encounter keeping your ants. So today's episode is going to be on curly winged flies. So these are house flies, but of a recessive genetic strain that doesn't develop fully functional wings. And the benefits of this are they are flightless, so they cannot buzz around the house causing a nuisance. They're also good as a food as they cannot harm your ants in any way. Um, the way that they turn up is in a tub, in the pupae state. They soon hatch after they have arrived to you and this guarantees maximum freshness. And you can find certain dealers in the live foods that are ethically sourced and are only fed organic material before they're delivered straight to your door. They're relatively easy to keep alive and to look after, but I have noticed that they don't last too long once you've got them in the little pre-packed tubs. So I would recommend prioritising these over your other live foods, so you get the most out of your purchase. As for feeding these curly wings to your ants, you can go two ways. You can use one of the various methods to, to mainly put them down and to make sure that there's no nasty parasites or anything with the boiling water or freezing method or you can put them in for larger colonies alive as they are now but this is only for larger colonies that are going to be able to hunt them and actually take them down without it causing too much stress so there's everything you need to know about curly winged flies for your ants and I hope you found this video helpful and interesting and I'll be bringing more videos of more commonly kept live foods for your ants in this small series. Thanks for watching guys and I'll catch you again.